Now, from the studios of Into Tomorrow in Miami, this is ITTV. One of the challenges that teachers continues to face is keeping students engaged. Our next guest is the co-creator of a product that helps teachers connect with their students in a new and very unique way. You've got to come and see the video at intotomorrow.com and you'll see what I'm talking about. He is the CEO and founder of Pathway Innovations and Technologies and co-creator of eGlass. G. Shen, G. welcome into tomorrow. How are you, sir? Good. Thank you for having me, David. It's a pleasure. Uh, where are you joining us from today? It's from San Diego, California. Ah, very fine, very fine. Well, glad to have you with us. Uh, tell me a little bit about Pathway Innovations and Technologies, and then we'll get into eGlass, because I'm very anxious for our audience to see what you're doing with eGlass. Very cool. Pathway has been a technology company in the educational field. We've been developing classroom instructional technologies such as uh, most people in the educational field know about a document camera. Um, it's also called a visualizer in Europe, uh, but it's a camera that captures a live stream that kind of uh, project that onto a bigger screen for students in the classroom to see. It also works in the um, remote learning environment. Uh, we also have a digital teaching station that integrates a a computer with a multi-touch screen and the document camera into the form factor of digital podium. Uh -huh. And our latest uh, technology is eGlass. It's a new way of, it's a new medium, the new way of engaging students. What's the inspiration behind it? Uh, what caused you to kind of create this unique approach? COVID really disrupted our world and including educational field that makes uh, remote learning, distance learning uh, and student engagement into the limelight and has become a household issue. Everybody is really concerned with it. And I experienced that firsthand. My kids were not really learning very well. Uh, and uh, so we really wanted to find a solution to this. Um, I think engagement is all about um, what, what can make uh, students achieve better in learning. So uh, without, without engagement, uh, you know, there's no chance for learning achievement. So uh, eGlass is really created to address this issue. So uh, describe before you show it to us, uh, again on the video at intotomorrow.com, describe for the radio audience who perhaps has not yet seen this video, what eGlass is and how it works. And then I'm going to ask you to demonstrate it for us. eGlass is the illuminated glass writing board with the integrated camera and the uh, digital imaging software. Altogether, it put the teacher right in the same picture with the information being uh, presented. And it allows teacher to be, uh, to be embodied with the information and it never have to turn their back on the students. So this is a new medium is a new paradigm shift. So uh, it, it, it's a, is a new way to engage students because the uh, when, when teacher write on this glass, the illuminated glass uh, basically create this neon glow for any text you write onto the, the board mm -hmm. and uh, that really gets their attention. So the integrated camera makes a uh, very clear image, uh, a smooth, fast video, and also flips the image so it appears correctly in the classroom and also appears correctly for uh, like an application like Zoom or any other uh, uh, online apps. So I know so I'm, I'm, I'm dating myself when I say as compared to a chalkboard because recent years most classrooms are using a whiteboard and a dry erase marker or something like that. So again, for especially for the radio audience, as you mentioned, the teacher has to kind of turn their back to the class and then draw or write or put an assignment up or what have you. E-glass uh, is sort of like, as I understand it, like holding a big sheet of glass in front of the teacher and the teacher's almost writing on it backwards, 
but it's not backwards. And it's, of course, uh, as you say, your software, your program automatically flips it. So now on our video, for those watching and those know they can visit us into tomorrow.com, check for the interview with G. Shen from Pathway Innovations. Show us how eGlass works. Yeah, I'm right in front of eGlass. So this sheet of glass is right in front of me and it's illuminated. You can see me clearly. Now I can write, let's say I write e-glass shatters engagement barriers. And of course, it's coming out as if you're amazingly able to write backwards, <laughs> but you're not having to do that. Uh, your program not is very is, gifted. Is, but. <laughs> <laughs> we we uh, we used to have a, a weatherman here in Miami, uh, Weaver the weatherman, who did all of his weather forecast by writing things backwards. So the camera would just point through a plexiglass, and and people were always amazed by that because he was gifted <laughs> in order to write backwards and sunny and a temperature and that kind of thing. Uh, but he was actually writing backwards, and, and that looked wow. like what you were doing, but it comes out perfectly. So if a, if a teacher is listing an assignment or just writing some certain verbiage uh, or maybe even uh, the chemical makeup of something, you know, and having to draw, uh, it comes out perfectly, and you can still see the teacher doing it. I think that's very unique. Yes, and as you were just saying, I could bring in digital content as well. Um, oh, okay, now I'm seeing like a DNA symbol. Like a of, DNA yeah. helix. Uh, exactly. Yeah, so I could annotate on top of this. You know, I could write whatever the, the name of the, the DNA yeah. pairs. Oh, that's awesome. So as I was writing, you could see I was gazing at the information and I could gesture with my body language. Mm -hmm. uh, my expressions is visible. So uh, when students see this, their attention is really directed to the, the right information of focus. Send the so uh, this when when also the, the teacher look into the camera, uh, the students feel like they are right there and the teacher is looking at them in the eye. Now, for example, G, how can you uh, eliminate or move the DNA helix on your screen so that we can see you better? <laughs> ah, so apparently with the push of a, button, of a button, yeah, click yes. of a button, it's gone. And now he's erasing uh, certain things that were on the screen, like a normal eraser. It looked like a, a, a normal, like a rag or something, a piece of cloth. Just and a rag, you can, you can erase the, the text on this. Gotcha. Awesome. So then can you bring in anything else like, you know, a logo or or uh, a picture of something that you're you're trying to share with your class at that point? And would this be done only for distance or remote learning or would can this be used actually in the classroom as students finally get back into school? Yes, that's a, a great question. And I think it actually works very well in the classroom setting as well. As well. So, uh, what I'm bringing up here is a um, uh, another image, uh, another content. I just went to a website, and um, I was going to say we almost so we almost a, had to censor the image, but now I see what you're doing. Okay. <laughs> sorry, but uh, no, 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 it's, it's fine. More about anatomy. <laughs> yes, exactly. So, this is a 3D human model, medically uh, accurate one, and. Uh, so here I am, and I'm behind this uh, transparent image. Um, I can manipulate it, and I, at the same time, I could um, point to it with mm. real ink. Yeah. So we're really effectively blending the physical world with physical ink and the digital media. So this is what I meant as a brand new media. And, and I'm assuming, uh, go ahead, I'm assuming that teachers are quite amazed by this technology as well. Have you had some very positive feedback about it? Absolutely. So some people have used this in the classroom. Some teachers have used it for remote uh, learning sessions. And uh, we were told, some teacher were telling us, one teacher told us um, once 
the 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 e glasses turned on, students turned on their cameras too, and they started talking in the classroom, and the engagement level just went through the roof. Students have not been engaging in the distance learning environment in, in recently. So this is uh, really giving them almost like a shock and it felt amazing. The attention uh, is really focused in, in learning. Well, one of our producers in the control room just reminded me that this Hovercam uh, document scanner and product was one of yours that you created years ago and we actually use one and keep it here in the studio. And so That's I didn't amazing. just bring yes. it in for this interview. This is something that your company provided us with many years ago, and we've utilized it here in the studio since then. So that's very yes, cool. Yes, Love glad it. to see that. That's a ten-year-old model, but yeah. uh, well, we see, have, it shows moved, we like your technology. Uh, yes, we have moved down with the performance, improved the performance a lot uh, since then. But um, yeah. That's one of the cameras. Yeah, oh, very cool. Now, is eGlass available? And, and if you want to lose the uh, the skeleton diagram, that's fine. We can see you more. Um, yeah. Is this available to uh, schools now? How is it priced? Uh, is there uh, available to the public for that matter? Yes. Uh, our first production, we have sold thousands. Um, and uh, uh, people are really excited about them and they are available for pre-order right now for the next production batch. Uh, we really can't make fast enough. I'm sure. And again, do you have a price yet so teachers, schools, and or parents can get an idea? Uh, we have two models, a 35 inch and a 50, 50 inch. So what I'm using is the 35 inch and the 35 inch is roughly about $2,000 and the 50 inch is about $3,000. Okay, and again, physically, it's a screen that's in front of, in this case, your webcam, I'm assuming, right? Yes. Okay, so it's very easy to put together. You simply put it on your desk and, and then point your camera through it and then engage it with software, I'm guessing. Yes, so it came with this special purpose High performance camera is high resolution and is, it flips the image and also gives you the right optimal uh, depth of field and field of view and has no distortion. And also the, this technology, the camera and the glass works together, gives you this much free and clear, evenly glowing uh, text display. So, um, and, the, and the software then blends digital and the physical ink uh, together. Mm. I love it. And I love how you can obviously, as you've demonstrated, again, you'll see the video at intotomorrow.com, how you've demonstrated how it's so easy to bring up an image or a website or, or do anything along those lines that you want to help teach your students. I'm assuming that it's really for any age group or any class of kindergarten on up, it would seem. We are uh, really targeted to help every teacher and every student. We want everyone to benefit from this because we really uh, were concerned that kids were not learning. We don't want to lose them. Uh, so it, it's really applicable for K through 12 and higher ed. So also people in, in business could use as well. Um, Anybody who want to present idea, draw a diagram, present um, uh, like a presentation slide, like PowerPoint slides, mm -hmm. you could uh, be embodied in the same information in the same picture. Fascinating and, and so much more effective than just a normal screen share that people have been limited to at this point. Because, you know, while you still may be seen, now you're thrown in a, in a corner of the screen or something uh, very small and to, in order to share your screen so your students aren't really seeing your reactions as a teacher and so forth. So I think it's fascinating and we uh, hope you keep up the good work because I can see where this can be very, very handy. And uh, our audience can visit eglass.io. 
eglass.io. And of course, we'll get you there too. And of course, uh, G. Shen is actually writing it on his screen. <laughs> Looks backwards, but there it is, eglass.io. Uh, G, you're a delight to chat with. And, and I think uh, very cool things are coming out of the Pathway Innovations and Technologies Labs. Keep up the good work. Thank you, Dave. Thank you for having me. It's our pleasure. Again, the CEO and founder of Pathway Innovations and Technologies, G. Shen. And you want to visit eglass.io, as in electronic glass. Very easy to remember that way. And of course, when you visit us at intotomorrow.com, we'll get you to G's site as we do all of our guests one click away. And of course, we want to hear from you. And what do you think of eglass and more help like this for education technology. We love it. Intotomorrow.com. We're back with more as we bring you further into tomorrow right here on the Advanced Media Network.